Hi, and welcome to a Slice of Wood workshop with your host, Timothy Charles. Today we're going to be going over how to make wine bottle balance holders. Um, it's a very cool design. You stick the wine bottle in there, it rests on the side like this, and it balances out nicely. So we're going to go over some quick, simple things. Uh, a project that takes maybe a half an hour. We're going to go from a block of wood to this and uh, get the finished outcome. So uh, stick with me and here we go. Alright, so here I have a piece of red oak that um, I just had laying around. Uh, I actually got it off of a pallet and uh, have cleaned it up, planed it down. Um, it's three quarter inches thick um, by about three inches wide. Um, all I'm going to do is take, take it on the miter um, saw, clean up one end, uh, one edge and then flip it around and cut the angle on this other one so uh, we'll go ahead and do that real quick and my measurement that the measurement that I'm getting um, you can make them however long you want. Um, you can do all different designs. Um, I'm going to go and cut mine at 9 inches in length. Um, and the angle, the angle that I'm going to be cutting it at is right at about um, 30, 36 degrees. Um, which works pretty well. And then once you get it a cut at that, then you drill your hole and uh, and then you just fine tune it from there. Okay, like I said, it was uh, the board was about three inches wide before. I just went ahead and measured it, and it is three and a quarter inches wide. Um, I'm centering it at about five, one uh, inch and five eighths inches in the middle, and you can kind of put your hole anywhere you want. I'm gonna actually go ahead and put mine at two and a half inches down, um, and uh, my bit size is an inch and three eighths. I tried it with an inch and a quarter, and it really wasn't wide enough for the bottleneck to go into. Um, inch and three eighths is kind of tight. You can almost go about an inch and a half, um, and it'll probably work out a little bit better. But uh, I like how it is right now. It holds it really good. So uh, let's go ahead and get this hole cut. Um, one thing I do want to mention real quick is that uh, on a couple of other pieces that I've done, when you drill all the way through, it actually tears out on the back side and it doesn't look all that great. So just kind of remember that when you're doing it, go about halfway, three quarters of the way through, and then you can flip it over and just go right back down, um, drilling until it's cut on the other side. And uh, it'll leave a real nice edge around on both sides. All right, here's the last and uh, it could be the final step if you want to make it that. Um, I've got the angle cut, the hole is cut, the hole is not cut at any angle. This was cut at 35, 36 degrees, um, and it's time to start test fitting it. Um, it's not finished in any way, not sanded or anything like that. Um, all you gotta do is take your bottle, take that, slide the neck of the bottle in there, and boom, it balances right there. Uh, like I said, that's a pretty good angle. I know a lot of people have questions about it. Um, and the angle can also be adjusted by how far you have the bottle sticking out of the hole, how far it is. As you can see, this one is pretty much almost all the way in there, um, and that's how it's balancing. Now, you can do all sorts of different things with this now. You can leave it all squared off if you'd like. Uh, I don't really like the square edges. So I've got one right here that we actually have inside. Um, I have taken a router bit and you uh, quarter inch round over bit and routed the outside edge and the circle in the middle 
uh, and that does, I did not do this back side, um, but it doesn't affect the balancing of it all. You still stick it in there, and it makes absolutely no difference. Um, just, I think it looks a little bit nicer having that little, uh, little curve on it. But you can finish them however you want, natural finish them. This one was pine. I used golden oak uh, from Minwa uh, Minwax. Uh, but uh, that's pretty much it. Go have fun. They make great uh, Christmas gifts. Any kind of gifts, retirement gifts, whatever. Put a wine bottle with it. You put wood, in, uh, veneer wood together. Um, do whatever you want. So uh, enjoy it. Mm -hmm.